Hi, meteorologist Peter Hall. Here's your CNY Central First Alert weather forecast. And as we look ahead for the rest of the day, it's cloudy. And it looks like the clouds are going to be increasing. There may be just a smidge of sun if you're watching this very early, but then becoming mostly cloudy with only limited peaks of sun. Despite all the clouds, at least during the daytime hours, and there's only going to be like a passing sprinkle or shower. The more important rain ah, that begins around or especially after midnight tonight. And that brings us to a very soggy raw start to Saturday. Overall, it is going to be warm today over much of the area. We're talking upper 60s, to the lower 70s. But after that, it is cooling conditions. I just mentioned that we're likely to have some of the steadiest rain in the forecast tonight, but not until late tonight into Saturday morning. Localized showers for Saturday night and Sunday, I think, and as I'll show you in the future cast, a lot of those are going to be north of Syracuse Saturday night. A few of them close by Sunday, but then we got to watch a wave of low pressure late in the day for maybe some more steady rain. So here we go. Increasing and thickening clouds. There's not exactly a lot here on the Futurecast radar. You see that there's a little spr sprinkle or light shower trying to pass through at times. But here's where the heaviest rain's coming in, right in there. See that? Late at night and during the morning hours Saturday? Yeah, that, that likely means a, a kind of wiped out Saturday morning. If you've got plans Saturday morning, it's likely to be raw, wet, rainy. Some late afternoon clearing. Maybe we can salvage the finish of the day. Much of the morning, it's like 49 or 50 degrees with rain. Late in the afternoon with some limited sun, it's 54 to 59. Sort of is like that Tom Petty and Jeff Lynn song, Free Fallen, although it, it's just kind of just keying on the word autumn for fall there. Showers, but local Saturday night. Notice that a lot of them are east of Lake Ontario. East and southeast of Lake Ontario is where we should have at least some lake effect showers. But remember I mentioned a wave of low pressure. Well, let's talk about that with a probability here. Yeah, we have a pretty good chance for some localized showers on Sunday. But for the last several days, I've been mentioning that there may be some rain other than just lake effect trying to affect the area at the finish of the day Sunday into Sunday night. Our computer models keep flip flopping on this thing, whether they want to do it or not, or it stays dry or not. I'm going with the gut and saying let's keep in some widespread rain at the finish of Sunday into Sunday evening. I don't want to take it out of the forecast because I, I think our, our computer models are underdoing it the way everything's set up. So we should come out of some of the coolest there for just a day or so on Tuesday where we're back into at least a normal high of 64 with sun. But then we're going to dip, we dip, you dip and everything Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. It's going to be chilly once again as there's likely to be more unsettled weather. So overall, it is going to be rather chilly after today. Today isn't too bad, though. Yeah, not the sunniest day you've ever seen, but upper 60s, to lower 70s, no slouch. Remember, tomorrow it's going to be in the 50s. Well, it's in the 50s today for a high in Michigan. Oh, wow, look how cold it is in the upper Midwest today. It's not getting out of the 30s today in Duluth. Now that's a very fallish air pattern where you've got 90s and 30s in the country in the lower 48 for that matter. In terms of the bigger picture, part of the reason why it's not going to rain a lot during the days is just not that many showers in the cloud cover we have now, but there will be a wave of low pressure that rings out some rain during the late night hours tonight into tomorrow morning and that's located right in here and that'll be moving over the area tomorrow morning. I'm meteorologist Peter Hall. Anytime, anywhere, download our CNY Central mobile app.